showing you how to make phone calls and receive phone calls from the iPod Touch. Um, this is the iPod Touch. If you don't believe me, it says iPod right there. It's not the iPhone. So yeah, I'll first show you, show you it. Okay, what you need to do is go download Fring from the App Store. So, let it load real fast. Go to search it. Then type in F-R-I-N-G. So, Fring, that's what it is. And it's free. So, when you have it downloaded, open it up. And it'll, it will tell you to make an account. Just make one real fast. It's free. So when you make one, you should on the bottom it should say buddy list history dialer go to and more. And you should Okay, yeah, that that's really all. Now just turn off your iPod for now. Go to your computer and in the address bar type in www.voipbust dot com so it is voipbuster dot com um mm. oops it's voipbuster dot com I'll have the I'll have the link on the side on the description wait up it's not working real fast Okay. All right. When you go to the site, it should look like this: Void Buster. Um, click download. It's free and everything. You don't have to pay. Click download. The Void Buster, and then save it to your desktop. When you save it, um, run run the program. And then it will tell you to make an account. Just make a really fast account. It's free. And yeah, you should be set. Use your real email address, and that's really all I asked for. Okay, after you're done setting up your account, go back to your iPod. Go back to Fring. Okay, click More. Click Add ons. Click SIP Voip Buster and then type in your information the reason I use Voip Buster instead of Voip Stunt is because Voip Stunt doesn't work for me anymore I used to use that but it does not work for me anymore so I just use this so you click SIP Voip Buster and just fill in your information and when you're done you should see a little check mark on the side of SIP that's how you know and if you go to the dialer the SIP button right here should be lit up and Skype is like blacked out and SIP should be lit up so yeah alright that so now you can make calls but to receive calls you need to go on the computer again go to www dot i p k a l l dot com so IP call right there I'll also have that link in the description. So when you get to this page, click sign up. It's free. So yeah, don't worry about that. Alright, the account type should be SIP. The area code, uh, you could choose out of whatever you have. The SIP phone number, this is really important. It is the username you used on Voipbuster when you signed up. So, it's not a phone number, it's just your username. Pretend my username was David. So, yeah. Um, the, F the SIP proxy is sip.voipbuster.com. So, it's sip.voipbuster.com, if you can see that. The email address is the same email address you used in um, when you signed up. Same goes for the password. You have to use the same one that you used um, on the Voipbuster when you signed up. 
the number of seconds I recommend doing 20 seconds and then after that you should click add it. you should fill that in and submit then you go to your email and then you should get one email and it says your your uh, number is pending and in about a day check back in a, about a day you'll get another email that says your phone number so all right, I'll show you it now so I'm gonna make a call to my cell phone alright I don't want you to see my cell phone number so All right here, it's calling. I don't know if you could hear it, it's kind of low. And here's my cell phone. All right, it's lit up. All right, it says unknown number. And when I pick up, and now it says call in progress. Hello? Hello? I'm making a call from my iPod touch. So yeah. That was calling out. So call ended. So you're wondering how do I call from my cell phone into the thing? So that's where that number comes in of your oops. Alright, iPod. So th this is this number you should get when when you get your email address. Alright. It's calling the iPod right there. And now it's in right. Hello? Hello? I'm on my iPod and I just called. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty much calling on the iPod Touch and receiving calls. Um, I don't have a microphone. I'm going to go get one. And it's all free. You don't have to pay or anything. Um, yeah, that's really all. All you need is a microphone, which is probably about 20 or 30, 20 bucks. Probably. I don't know. Don't ask me. All right. So thank you for watching.